guys, so today I'm going to be doing another Hermit Crop update video. And yeah, so let's just go ahead and get right into it. So as you can see, it does look pretty different from last time. So I'll just start over here in this corner. And what I just got here is just this little, like, um, I don't really know what you would call it, but it's just like a little stone pond, I guess. It's just like has a little frog thing and like a little log and these little flowers and then just like water or whatever just paint off not like actual pond or anything but I thought it was really cute I got it in like the fairy garden section at a store near me and I thought it was really cute so I decided to pick it up and we actually do have um, fairy gardens which I if you want to see a video like of a tour of our little fairy garden uh, just comment down below because I think that would kind of be a fun video to do sometime and yeah so we had originally gotten it for the fairy garden but um, it was actually a little too big to fit in the area that we wanted it in so I decided just to put it in here because I had been wanting something new to change it up but didn't really see anything at the pet store but I think it's really cute and I think my hermit crowds will enjoy getting to kind of just climb over it around it and everything so yeah and then back here is still just our food dish blues in there right now eating <laughs> um and then over here is the shell area I used to have the shell sort of scattered like around but I decided just to keep them all right here for now because uh, we have a little bit less space <laughs> now that we added this and yeah, and then back there is still our little turtle guy, and um, he's going to be friends with the little frog guy, so. And then back there is just the same bridge, and then over here is the coconut hut, Paris, Ashlyn, and River are in there right now. I would pick it up to show you, but I don't really want to bother them, so. And then over here is their water dish, still in the same spot, that I just moved the castle from right here to over there, um, because this used to be over here, but... I just swapped them out to have something new plus to make more room for this one so yeah and then um I still just put the little shell against the water dish because I think it looks really cute like that but the hermit crabs always move that around <laughs> and then over here is just like another little shell that's sticking out of the sand and then under here is Remy right there you can't even see her but you can sort of see the outline of her shell it's kind of dark <laughs> Um, but yeah, and so I think that's really everything that is new. But another thing that I like about this setup is now the water dish is a little bit closer to this castle, and that's good because my hermit crab, Otis, um, always is in the castle, like, all the time, and I don't even know, like, if he comes out for food or not. I'm kind of... I kind of think that he does that because I'm sort of thinking that he may get bullied by the other crabs so he may be scared to come out or something so I always put in food in his castle for him just in case so I don't really know what to do about that if you have any suggestions comment them down below but um, now he can be a little bit closer to the water as well so if he feels scared or if the other hermit crabs may be trying to hurt him he can just get there pretty fast and then get back in um because I also kind of put some water in there for him as well like on a little like leaf so he'll have water too just in case because he always is just in there so I mean I'm sure he does come out but I just never see him come out and he, every time I check he's always in there so yeah I just want to make sure that he's okay and yeah, I've never actually seen any of the other hermit crabs picking on him. He may just be shy, but I mean, or maybe they really do just kind of scare him. So he's definitely my introvert hermit crab. So yeah, he just stays in there. So that's another thing I do like, but yeah. So anyway, here is the whole tank. And yeah, I think that's about all for this video. So I hope that you enjoyed because I decided to make this because I'd gotten so many, um, people commenting telling me that they wanted to see another hermit crab update so I'm definitely going to start doing these updates way more often because guys there were so many of you that asked so I'm really happy that I can make this one for you but yeah so thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video bye everyone